no, another one spawned. Good night. Hey, how's it going? Good to have you back for part 10 and the final part of this blind playthrough of Skyrim Civil War storyline. So here we are at the final battle of Windhelm and it looks like we have to pop over to Windhelm and have a little chat with good old General Tullius, who's almost as much of a little chuckle monkey as is Legate Wicker. Let's see how this all works out, shall we? Let's crack on. Okay, so I think we've got to listen to his rousing speech or can we just blast right in? Good one, mate. Yeah, cool story, bro. Right, let's. Uh, oh, must help soldiers. We've got to listen to his speech, haven't we? Uh, Oh, like a steel sword. Right, that's it. Let's go, boys and girls. Okay, so I think this is just going to be absolutely mayhem. I think it's been the same as all the other ones, except more so. Okay, let's just start whacking people. Okay, where am I going? Okay, right, let's go up here. I haven't seen... Where's little Cedric gone? I've got, got to look out for him. He's a weak tool out of my death crew. I mean, I've given him some amazing armour. Which should protect him to a certain degree, but uh, still. He's my little blue baby. Where are they all gone? Okay, right. Right, that's one. Where are they all gone? The whole lot of them, the whole death crew disappeared somewhere. Oh well. We'll see what happens at the end. Good night. Oh, that reminds me, I'm going to buy a house there. Oh, God, skin. <laughs> Oh, they're doing me some damage this time. We've got the. Uh, I'm playing this on the uh, master difficulty, by the way. Right, let's quick regen. Okay. And let's get back into the fight. Okay, for you from behind. Oh, this is actually quite intense. <laughs> There's a lot of the little bastards. No, you can't miss me. Okay. Oh, you're kidding me. Okay, I think... Uh, Let's quickly have a little freshen up there. Yeah, sorry guys, I'm concentrating on this. There's, um, there's a fair few of little buggers. Okay, right. Let's have a quick look. I think I need to cheer. Yeah, I've got to charge this. Okay, let's go for a great one. Yeah, yeah, do another one. Yeah, fully charged it. Yeah, yeah, that'll do. Okay, let's get cracked straight into the battle. Battle? <laughs> straight into the battle. <laughs> I thought we cleared this one out. Okay, yes. Stop them. Right. Oh, good night. Okay. Getting tired yet? 
Okay, you pop some more boys in. Okay, let's crack on. Let's just get this thing done. <laughs> I feel better equip my sword. <laughs> okay. Well, actually, I want to buy a house up here. And I think after this is done, I think I'm... I think I can buy it. But I still think I've got to do that damn blood in the ice quest before I can furnish it, I think. Anyway, I'll do a, a little walkthrough on that. I'm taking damage here, guys. Yeah, these guys are putting up a decent fight. Okay. Goodbye. God, these two enchantments are chewing up my um, my soul gem charge. I think we're getting there. Okay, are we there? I think we're there. Right, now it's time to go and see old Uthric himself. Sorry about the narration, guys. I'm really concentrating on this. There was, there was swarms of them. Okay, let's charge this up again. I'll do. Yeah, I think we're all done. Oh, no, another one spawned. Good, nice. Okay, but for Windham, okay. I think we ought to just go in. Okay, now we'll wait a little bit for a two list to pop up. There he is. Is that it? Where's the death crew? Ah, oh, sorry, we'll wait for them. Or oh, they can catch me up. Okay, right. Let's try something. Let's try a bit of salt here. Alfred Stormcloak. You are guilty of insurrection. Murder of Imperial citizens, the assassination of King Torik, and high treason against the Empire. It's over. Not while I'm still. Well, did a little bit of damage, but not as much as I hoped. Go on, you stay down. Well, Alfred. Die, villain! Right. For Let the, the dragon call yourself and enjoy you. killing you. Die, for the Emperor! It'll make for a better song. Yeah, I think this is glitching Sorry out a little not. bit. I just want it done. Well, okay, I've got, you got the choice of killing him. Uh, they didn't even give me a chance to actually make the choice. <laughs> they just killed him. I think you meant to give him the choice of whether you, you want to kill him yourself or not. He wants you to kill him. Um, as far as I understand, and uh, this didn't give me the chance well, to actually say I would or I wouldn't do it. But hey, his blood's not on my hands, so that's it. Job done. Runwolf. Yes, I've sent men to protect him and bring him here. Windhelm will need a government quickly if we are to prevent more violence. The Legion will be staying here for quite some time. I don't expect it to be any further violence. Oh, and Legan. It's been an honor to have you on my side. As a token of my appreciation, I want you to keep me safe. Now to deliver a speech. Oh, okay, so I'm, oh yeah, I'm a legget now, aren't I? Oh bloody hell! There you go. Rebellion is over. Alfred Stormcloak is dead. Yeah, I'm more worried about my death crew here. Uh, I should treat him with a bit of honour. Turning the city over to Brunwolf Freewinter, an honorable and faithful man. Many of you will be staying in Windhelm to aid the Jarl in restoring order and stamping out oh, the embers come. of rebellion that may still smolder here. In appreciation for your exemplary service, I am doubling your pay and compensation to the widows of your fallen comrades. Yeah! 
Oh, that's good. The whole death crew I here: Cedric, Genesa, Serana, and Serana's mum. That's cool. I hope we haven't just created a fire. There's bound to be resistance. There are many stormcloak camps tucked away in the hills. They'll no doubt strike whenever and wherever they can. But without Ulfric to inflame their passions, they'll settle down and return to their homes. I pray you're right. I guess there's some side quests you can do on this. Um, well, I'm not going to bother. This is done. Uh, and I'll try and get the house in Windhelm. And I'll probably have to, if I have to have to do the Blood Nice quest, I'll do that as well. A proper walkthrough on that. Okay, will you turn to Cyrodiil now? I can't say I'll ever get used to the damn cold or understand these Nords. But I've come to respect them. The harshness of Skyrim has a way of carving a man down to his true self. The fiercest now that Ulfric is dead, will there be peace? To harass us, but by and large, the people here desire peace. What I'm not so sure about is the peace we've made with the Thalmor. But we'll keep that between the two of us. Now that's interesting. So uh, he's not happy about the peace with the Thalmor. So I wonder if um, in the next Elder Scrolls um, there may be war with the Thalmor. Now I'd love that because I hate those bastards. So uh, I take great joy in slaughtering them. Anyway, so that's it. That's done. Um, I'll probably get the house and probably have to do the Blood and the Ice quest, which I'll do as a proper walkthrough. And I hope you enjoyed this, guys. It's not been the best storyline in the game, I don't think. Um, it could have been a lot better, but I'd like to say thanks to Death Crew there. They've made it all possible. Hope you enjoyed the vid, guys. See you later. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please leave a like, leave a comment, and please do subscribe. If you'd like to see more videos like this, then push the bell next to the subscribe button after you subscribe, obviously. Later.